Ah, yes. George and Samantha, what a lovely couple. Love is in the stitches, some say. Being together is all they ever needed. But then, one day, a wind came from nowhere. Whoosh. The strong gust swept Samantha off to an unknown place, away from George. She was gone. George was heartbroken. Crying for his beloved, he heard a voice from above. The time has come to prove your love, George. Who are you? George asked. Where's Samantha? This is the beginning of your story, George, the voice said. You must find a way to complete it. Suddenly, George was sucked away. George's quest to find Samantha had brought him to a very strange place. Where am I? What's going on? He asked aloud to no one, because no one else was there. George was alone. He quickly realized that his weight was important in this new place. That was surprising. Almost as surprising as the floating letters he saw. How is this possible? And what are they doing here? He wondered. Thank <laughs> you. 
This place was definitely weird. George noticed a tightly wound ball of blue thread hanging over his head. It reminded him of his childhood for some yarn reason. He reached up to get a closer look and bang! Suddenly, he was blue and bigger. But how? His big blue self had the urge to stretch. Yes, stretch way out and boom! Then, just as suddenly, he was red again and staring directly at a copy of himself. What is going on? How is there another red version of me? Have I been cloned? <laughs>